Hi friends, welcome to Tutors Funny Channel. In our last class, we saw how to add the teachers and how to view the teacher details. Now, in this class, I am going to teach how to edit and remove the teacher details. Right? So, let's back to our log cost database. We are open the database first. Now, here, first, what I am going to do is here. I am going to design the form, right? So, uh, the same stu edit student uh, .jsp page, I just copy, select the web pages folder, paste it. Right. Now, here, this time, I am going to change this one as a edit teacher, edit teacher. Edit teacher, right? Okay. This, this page should be edit teacher. Now here we have to edit the details of the teacher's details, right? So very simple stuff to edit the de de teacher details. So here teacher details, what are the uh, uh, what was uh, these are there? Teacher details. We have a uh, go to the teacher at teachers page, right? So we have to check the teacher details. These these are the fields are there. Uh, student the same fields I am going to copy the same fields I am going to copy this all this all the things we have to this one all the things we have to copy up to phone number control seat copy uh, so we have to copy this one only this few I am going to copy this getting here and here Control C to copy back to edit uh, uh, edit teachers dot page this page we have to paste it from this tip. right we have to paste it yes now I am going to use the edit contents so let's check whether it's just that page is working or not uh, that's very helpful so let's select the index dot JSP page we have to select all. View teachers, click edit button. This goes to this page, but the data is blank, right? The, but the page which we visiting successfully along with the ID when you click that button. Now, here the problem is here, right? No, here what I'm going to do is here I'm going to load the teacher details, okay? So, this form this is a teacher form, okay? This form should be we have to change that to edit teacher. First time we have to edit the edit the details. We have to click edit details student uh, teachers. Okay. Now here first what I am going to go to the database. Our database. What's the database? Uh, my we have we just go to the database Asian College. That's a, that, that's the database we have created. We just visit that data particular database here. Now here we have to we already this, uh, do the stuff. We have to change this one here as values. We have to pass the value. So value value equal right. Now here we have to put it to all the stuff right. First we have to load the database details here. First we have to load the values right. When the, the when the ID is coming here in this page this ID the relevant det details should be we have to load at. So we have to get the ID this one. ID variable should be this one. This is the variable of the ID. We have to get the ID and pass in the ID over here. Select all from which table I am going to select teachers table. We already teachers table also we have to already we have to this is a teachers table. We have teachers tables are there. These are the columns are there. This is a registration number. Uh, so this is a teachers number. T we have a registration number. This ID. We are loaded. We have to put it into the relevant field. So value. We have to put it here. The same thing. Same edit. Uh, we have edit the student page. The value the value the same thing I just copy this the value control C to copy back to edit stitches to page the same thing you have to paste it here or here only thing we have to change here is we have to this one registration number the same same registration number after that we have to the same value you just copy paste over here change here is the thing is uh, what was the error okay the error is here okay. now here 
uh, we have changed second field this should be teacher name so yeah the structure we have changed this one as a select this one the teacher name just copy control c to copy this one paste it over here same thing same value this thing control c to copy control v to paste over here here we have to change this one as a this thing subject control c to copy subject same thing control c to copy control v to paste below here we have to change this one as a address control c to copy control v to paste here. after that the same thing control c to copy control v to paste here this one should be phone control c to copy phone okay. this is the thing we have to do okay when the load, load the details and put into here okay after that finally we have to just close the brackets right we have to close the bracket is finally we have to close the bracket now let's check and uh, now let's check whether it's working fine or not we have to save all index.jsv page view teachers page click carry button uh, what was there uh, you have to read the error first you have when you are getting the error number eight Hello. error is coming here Asian college teach uh, right the teachers the problem the problem is here we have a teacher here we have a wrong here the teacher the table name wrong here I have wrote teacher here I have a spelling mistake that that will be the reason so again we have save all and we have to refresh the details edit now here yeah, it's working perfectly well okay here we have this one we have changed that is teacher details not student details for it so here we have to change we are saying teacher details teacher details right keep in your mind that's the thing we have right after that we have to this all the stuff are correct now when you are change the things click submit button what happen is it's redirect to the same page when you click submit button what happen is it goes to the same page this is the form uh, this is a form the same page along with the post method edit student dot here we get all the values here we have create all the connection object message and color all the stuff get all the values and put into the relevant fields right so first field should be the name second field should be the first registration number t name control c to copy the same thing you have to put it here third one should be the subject control c to copy the same thing Control V to paste here. Sorry, not the here, here. After that, address and phone. After that, address and phone. So, there, yeah, right. Perfect. Things are perfect. Now, what I am going to do is only the, the V register driver, this all the stuff are correct. Now, we have to update the details. Here, we have to write here is teacher's table, we have to update. We have to specify the name of name of the table which is a teacher. Set first column is for the first column teacher name. Teacher teacher name teacher this one. We control C to copy this this one paste it here. Instead of writing, you just copy and paste it. Uh, you leave the spelling. You can write without a spelling mistake. Okay, this subject also is control C to copy. Second column this is a subject. Third should be the address control address font number is there okay teacher's table set teacher name subject address phone number so there where registration number the registration number coming okay subject address phone number right now we have to put it to first first column should be the teacher name teacher name is name we have to put it here second name as a subject the subject you right here subject control c copy second subject subject go here after that address control city copy control v to paste here after that phone number uh, that's the field sorry, there. the address are there. two times i have paste it here subject here say address control city copy phone number final should be the registration number control city copy control v to paste here why there's a problem here again the problem like right? teacher's name subject control subject address control seat copy control read which finally phone number control seat copy control seat, right now it goes to the relevant param uh, this uh, relevant fields and 
update the records when you are calling the PST update method the color should be changed as green here we have right updated here teachers updated successfully this is the thing we have right save all now let's run again run your run and check teacher click carry button it goes there successfully now instead of the subject java I write php click submit button error occurred what was the error error what was the error The error should be coming here. Teacher, update teacher table. Set first teacher name. Check with the teacher name, subject address, phone number. They are subject address, phone number, we are registration number. So here the first one, first one is the teacher's num uh, name. So what's the name you are coming here? Put it here, it goes here. Second one should be subject, it goes here. Uh, our address, it goes here. Address, phone number, it goes here. After that, uh, subject address phone number finally id id should be uh, the registration number is coming put it here registration number coming here it's calling teachers updated but both the error is not uh, we have to check with the fields where it's told it should be correct or not address t name subject address and phone number Here we have to check with the error. Simply, if you can't identify the error, we have to check the EAEX. This EX, we are pass it here. EX, right? This, uh, when the, this is a try, when you get any error of the try, it pass into the catch block. Catch block will be handled the error. Okay, so we have to pass this EX here. So let's select save all and we have to run the program again. You can check here the what is the post error here to edit. Change as just a change submit get the error, error occurred uh, table asian teacher the r here also the problem with the teacher name t a teacher that's the problem t a c h teacher what's the error the teacher the table so what's the wrong same table now okay here the table name is wrong control c to copy same name control v to paste here right the teacher name is wrong again i am going to execute the program and run and check View teacher, click edit button. Now if you are going to change the subject as PHP, click submit button. Teacher updated successfully. Perfect. It's working perfectly well. Okay, it's working perfectly well. Now view teacher, it's PHP. Okay, working fine. Now I'm going to go to discuss about the remove stuff. The same thing. The same student remove the page. Copy. Right click and copy. Select the web pages folder, right click and paste it. Double click and this one, we have to change this one as a remove teacher. Right. Double click and open it. This is simple stuff. Only thing we have changed here is we don't need anything to here. Only we have changed here is delete from teacher's table. The teacher table. We are registration number, all the stuff are same. Uh, this only thing we have to do well, after delete the stuff we have to visit the uh, our view after delete the stuff it visit to the it automatically visit to the teachers view teachers page early in, in student we have did after delete the uh, student row it automatically view to the view page of the student here after delete the teacher it it automatically moving to the teacher's name, right? So let's run and check. View teacher. 
click that edge it goes here successfully now if you click remove here is removed successfully they just remove successfully okay it's working perfectly well uh, if you go home you can see all the stuff are there add student add teacher view student view teacher all the stuff are there right uh, i done this project successfully simple jsp programming uh, if you have any doubt on this you can ask me it eh? this project i will be attached in my uh, website you will be able to download and you can practice thank you for watching if you have any doubt on this you can ask me anytime if you like my channel please subscribe me like me thank you for watching